नमस्ते दीदी नमस्ते नमस्ते ओवर इयर्स माय रिएक्शन टू अदर पीपल ओवर मेनी इवेंट्स हैज बिकम ए लिटिल डिफरेंट टर्न मींस आई एम लेस रिएक्टिव डे बाय डे and uh, i keep something reserved within myself while speaking to others even even what if do i you mean by reserved within yourself means um, i think that i will not uh, give everything out now hmm. uh, i want that there is something um, not to speak to or not to react from within and uh, i find that Most most of the cases and over when years after years, um, I become more um, what to say complacent complacent about uh, my own behavior. Uh, I sometimes I keep myself uh, happy, but sometimes if it is not, then I wait for the next uh, moment to come when I'll be happy. so i don't react in the sense um i don't spoil the relationship immediately so even if they are from the uh, my counterpart is in fault but still i don't react i keep that yes i will keep i will give some time uh and opportunity will come well when i will get the proper reaction from the my counterpart so like this i am now able to divide myself within two something keeping it and something to express yeah so what we'll notice is one is that we want to be happy all the time isn't it we yes. are not happy with moments of unhappiness also you will find that somewhere you want to be happy all the time you want to be calm you want to be comfortable you don't want to have that disturbed feeling within isn't it that yes. is one thing that we want it all the time we don't want it only sometimes like we ask that question you know is there any particular time of the day that you want to be unhappy and you don't want to be that way and this thing of you know what we are for it to be in line with the natural acceptance this is a very significant thing so you will find that you know whenever what you are is not in line with what you want to be then there is some slight disturbance we may not be aware of it right now but as we keep paying attention we will find that there is some disturbance also when we say that you know we have we control or we um express some part of it but not all of it we may still be thinking about it and we may not be aware of it so even though we are careful not to say some things in front of some people so that we don't spoil the relationship so that's good because at least we are not spoiling the relationship but more importantly something is going on within us and that may be causing disturbance within us and we may not be aware of it. sometimes it is more subtle some days you might just feel you know you're not in a good mood but you don't know why does it happen yes yes happen yeah so what is happening what is this not such a good mood this is something is going on within but we are not aware of it but we are able to notice that we are not totally happy something is wrong but we may not be able to put our finger to it and say what exactly happened or why so that's why we have to observe within because whatever we don't put out it is still there within us you know? mm. you are with your self 24/7 <laughs> you can't mm-hmm. escape that you can avoid talking to somebody at a time when you think that it might spoil the relationship so you avoid talking to them but you can't avoid what is going on within you because you are the one who is doing that 
you are also the one who can observe this. But when we are not observing, we don't know for sure what is happening. So we'll do that. We'll be doing that in the exercises. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Thank you.